Yes, Boone, I know what time it is. And yes, I do think it's fine. Look, I had a lot on my mind, okay? Just... Look, the, the less questions you ask now, the better, I guess. You know, you, you don't have to trust me. You don't have to be here. I appreciate you sticking around. But let's, um... You keep your demons and I'll keep mine. Okay? Now. Uh, I have to go and see Mr. House, and I want you guys to come with me. I've got your back. I appreciate that. Thank you, Boone. Veronica? Aw, just when the standing around was getting exciting. Okay, as you can see, you don't care. Thank you, Edie. You, you always... You always know what to, exactly what to say to me. Um, multitude, I want, I want to make something. Oh, you're a crafting bench. A very extensive crafting bench. Good God, look at all the stuff I can make with you. A knife spear. Weird. A gas bomb. Whoa. Doctor's bag. Bottle cap mine. Auto-inject stim packs. Automatic use of 50% health. Ooh. I, I, I didn't realise you were... You had that ability. Anyway. Let's go. Come on. Let's uh, try and avoid killing any more of the chairman. Although I really don't think that they'll draw the weapons against us after the, um, the, the debacle last night. Okay, way out this way. I thought Benny was a stand-up guy. Hard to believe he was a rat all along. Yeah. Hey, there's the high roller. Hi, high roller. How do people see me here? Is there a way of? Neutral NCR, liked by Novak, vilified by the Powder Gangers. Oh, I guess the chairman don't count as a uh, a faction. That's useful, <laughs> more than anything. Uh, oh yeah, hi. You're back. Find anything? <laughs> you... <laughs> you mean you didn't hear? It was like 12 hours ago. The, the, the gunfight? The dead... Bodies? He, uh, Benny's dead. Huh. Guess that makes me the boss. <laughs> Ring a ding. You're going to need your finger on the pulse more than you've got it right now if you're going to be the boss of anything. But yeah, enjoy your new position. Yeah. See you, kid. Kid. I'll give you kid. Took out half your gang and your top ranking man. Oh, kid. The eyes of the mighty Kaisar are upon you. He admires your accomplishments and bestows upon you the exceptional gift of his mark. Any crimes you may have perpetrated against the Legion are hereby forgiven. Kaisar will not extend this mercy a second time. My lord requires your presence at his camp at Fortification Hill. His mark will guarantee your safe conduct through our lands. Um... Uh... How did you find me here? I am the greatest of Kaisar's frumentari. It was not a challenge to find you. Nor is this my first visit to the Strip. Okay, why does Kaisar... And I believe it's pronounced Caesar, but why does Kaisar want to see me? Go to him, and you will understand. Seek Kaisar by way of Cottonwood Cove, south of Nelson. The Corsor Lucullus will be waiting. Hey, you there. I have a message for you. It's from Ambassador Crocker. Very important. Here you go. Why am I in such high demand all of a sudden? Uh, right, what's this message? 
And Master Crocker's note. I wish to speak with you immediately in regards to important matters. I trust you have learned enough in your travels to know that the New California Republic is an honourable nation engaged in a beneficent mission in the Mojave in general and New Vegas in particular. It is in addition a wealthy nation that well rewards persons who dedicate themselves to its national interests, whether for reasons patriotic or material. Allow me to reassure you that if you have committed any crimes or misdemeanors against the Republic, it is in my power to pardon misconduct of this sort. I stand ready to receive you at your earliest convenience in my offices at the New, Can uh, New California Republic Embassy at the south side of the Vegas Strip. God bless. God bless the NCR. Dennis Crocker. Ambassador extraordinary and pl 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 plen plenipotentiary Department of State. Excuse me, NCR. Uh, weird. Okay, um... What, I, and what was the other thing you gave me? Was it something I can wear? No? Okay. Mark of Caesar, yeah. Okay. <sighs> I have, excuse me, I have no intention of, of listening to what the Legion wants to say, if I'm honest with you. I was hoping not to take sides in the war, but then, I don't know. My decisions here would put me in a position to be interested in the outcome of the war, you know? Boone, what the hell happened to your face? There you go, that's better. Yeah, I... Oh, goodness, the light and effect is doing something weird to your facial hair. So... Both the NCR and the Legion suddenly want me. Mr. House wants to see me. The most powerful people in Vegas all want to see me. Right after I learned that I could become the most powerful man in Vegas, I am not willing to accept that any of this is a coincidence. And I am starting to be very mistrusting of the people around me. But still, I will go and see what Mr. House wants. These lights are very unnecessary, Victor. Could we turn these off? Well, howdy, partner. Good to see you again. Boss is waiting for you upstairs, so get a move on. Thank you, Victor. I see you brought some friends. Sorry, partner. But they're gonna have to stay outside. Um. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm only here to talk, right? So, sure, I'll I'll have it myself then. Come back soon now. Uh, would you guys mind waiting here? Should have brought something to read. I've got your back. Needy, you too. I'm sorry. Oh. Wait, hang on a sec. I'll sit tight. You were already waiting. What? Except you. You weren't waiting. Okay, well, um, I'll be back in... Well, you know, go come and have a drink or something. Just relax. I'll, I'll be back soon. Wow. Nice place. And this one's closed to the public, right? Hello, Securitrons. Victor. You see, now I know that you can flick between Securitrons, it's a lot less jarring to see you here. Where to, partner? Uh, the, the, the penthouse, I guess. Thank you, 
Victor. And, uh... Well, who are you? Well, hello, sugar. Mr. House is waiting for you in his office. Uh, and, and who might you be? I'm Jane, one of Mr. House's girls. We keep him <clears throat> entertained. We don't get many guests lately. Perhaps we can entertain you as well. <laughs> that sounds a bit creepy. <coughs> Excuse me, yeah. Uh, I'm. Uh, 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 bye. Okay, yeah, that's also creepy. Please don't do that. Hope the robots don't mind if I smoke in here. Hello? Mr. House? Hello? It's weird. I can see for miles here. All the blocky terrain outside. Hello? Mr. House? some uh, interesting taste in uh, artwork you've got there. What? There's only Securitrons here. Wait, Mr. House, are you a robot? Hello? Wait. No. Hang on. Are you Mr. House? Hello? I just saw a, a, a particular face faded over yours. I... Um... You wanted to see me? You've been a busy courier, haven't you? You take your obligation to deliver a package very seriously. An ethic for which I am grateful. I will admit, when you ignored my invitation, I predicted negative outcomes. But you have a way of exceeding expectations, don't you? Well, enough. Let's have the chip, then. Uh, I'm not courier. And uh, I have some questions first. I'll be happy to satisfy your every curiosity once the platinum chip has been delivered. Why do you need the chip? And also, what am I getting paid for this? Fine. Give me the chip and I'll pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? Mm. <sighs> Given what I've recently learned, Mr. House, I don't think it would be in my best interests to hand over this chip. Hmm. How shall I put this? Delivery of the platinum chip is non-negotiable. I invite you to think carefully about what you do next. Standing alone before me, surrounded by my heavily armed Securitron guards. If you attack me, you run the risk of destroying your platinum chip. By the time I was 30 years old, I was a billionaire 30 times over. I founded and ran a vast economic empire. Do you really think I'm going to let an upstart come into my home and ransom my property to me? I spent two centuries searching for the platinum chip. It's my invention, my property, mine! Now be a good courier and deliver it! I'm not afraid of you, Mr. House. Or am I? I'm keeping this chip. You are not... You are not responsible enough to hold this. You are clearly unstable. You needn't be afraid of me. It's my Securitrons that are going to kill you. 
Engaging target. Not if I can get out of here first. Which I don't think I can. Nope, I'm not gonna get out of here, am I? How are they... How did they fail to follow me here? the wrong repair guy to mess with. Or did you? You know what? I just had this strange feeling that Mr. House probably isn't to be trusted. Aww. I've got your back. Wait a second. Can I give you the platinum chip? No, I cannot. Right, okay. Yeah. I I have the, the this just the sneaking suspicion that Mr. House isn't a trustworthy individual. At least Maybe I've not enough information to go on, and I think I'll take Yes Man's advice and get to know some of the tribes. Nellis Air Force Base. That was the Boomers, wasn't it? Bit of Springs. I believe that was the Great Khan's. Uh, the fort. I don't know what that is. The hood of steel. Hidden valley. Hmm. Novak? Why is it telling me to go to Novak? I don't want... Kill or disable Mr. House? Hmm. Side bets. Make contact with the Brotherhood of Steel. Visit the White Glove Society. The Amurtas. Red Rock Canyon. Great Khans. And the Boomers. I need to visit Caesar. Oh, well, I've been asked to. I don't think I'm going to. Talk to Mr. House. I don't like the idea of that. Um, I need to talk to the ambassador as well on the south side of the strip. Right, we can learn about the people at the strip some other time. Right now I feel like my every move is being watched here, so let's go and talk to the NCR. 
and see what it is they have to offer us. And let's hope that nothing tries to kill us on the way there. Yep, thank you. Okay, so the security trons don't want to stop us. I'm really going to have to think about this Mr. House figure. It might be in my best interests to remove him from the playing field, so to speak. Where are we looking for the NCR here? Camp McCarran, is that it? California Republic Embassy at the south side of the Vegas Strip. Whoops. Where am I going? Am I heading north? I'm heading north here. Is it? It's outside of the Strip, isn't it? It's outside of Freeside, surely. There's been no NCR presence, other than actually in the strip there. There's been none in, uh... No, hang on. Maybe it's at the other, actually at the other side of the strip. The NCR weren't quartered here when I lived here. I know what you're thinking. Who oh, this guy, you grew up on the strip. I grew up in Freeside, actually. I lived in the strip for a little bit, but I was very sheltered. And, you know... To, who was in charge was never really my concern. Is it just me, or am I smoking more than usual? Hi. I assume we're still okay to go in. Very, very uneasy walking past the Lucky 38 now. Very uneasy. Oh! Just get the hell out of me. It's hard to sleep in this place, I tell you. Last night some girl was pounding on my door all night. Is that his stand-up routine? Um, right, okay, so that's the tops. That's the ultra looks. And... I don't know what that one's called, but I assume I'll have to learn something about it. Right, so. Ah, right, here we go. This is what we're after. This is what we're after, Boone. The NCR encampment. That's a fancy get up on your head there. Later. Uh, whoever you are. That's the, finally someone who hasn't heard of me and doesn't want to offer me some sort of Hello. shady contract. Hi there. Uh, can somebody tell me who's in charge around here, please? Or where to... It would seem we've uh, come during the aftermath of a raid. In CRM, I see. Yeah, sure it does. HQ. I think it's the embassy we need to go to, isn't it? Thanks for the single file. Uh, we won't go quietly. The Legion can count on that. I'm sure they can. Hi. Welcome to the NCR Embassy. How can I help you? Uh, I'm looking for the Ambassador. Ambassador Crocker can be found in his office through the door to my right and at the end of the hall. Thank you. I don't have time to give my life story to everyone that passes through. Is there something I can actually help you with? Why, what did I say? Tell me. I didn't mean that. Sorry. Sir? Yeah, thank you. Sorry. I... I there's no need to be rude. I, I, I clicked the wrong dialogue option. That happens in real life all the time. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Just uh, standing in a hallway, are you? 
Excuse me. Ah. You must be the ambassador. I'm going to take a seat, for I am not uncivilized. Although then I can't see you. This is ridiculously the placement of your office. Ah, I see you received my message. Good, good. I had something important to discuss with you. Um, go on then. I'm sure you've noticed that things are a little tense around here with all the issues between the NCR, the Legion, and Mr. House. It doesn't take a genius to see that something big is going to happen soon. To be honest with you, the NCR is in a tight spot. But... If we fail now, it's the people here that are going to suffer the most. I'm not willing to let that happen, and I don't think you're the kind of person that would either. I'm listening. Please continue. To the northeast is a settlement. The locals here call them boomers. They are sitting on a munition stockpile that would be invaluable to us. I would like you to get in contact with them, and then do whatever it takes to convince them to help us. Unfortunately, the boomers keep to themselves and are, let's say, hostile to all outsiders. That's why I need someone like you. Someone with your background and reputation would have a better chance of reaching them than anyone I have available. In exchange for your help, you would receive complete amnesty for any past crimes against the NCR, as well as additional benefits and perks. Do you think you would be able to do this for me? Hmm. I suppose I could talk to them. <clears throat> I happen to want to swing by that way anyway so I suppose it can't do any harm much appreciated once you've talked to them come back and let me know if they will help us okay I will do uh... um, can you tell me some more about the NCR please I can provide a quick history lesson if that's what you're looking for in 2274, President Kimball sent the NCR army into the Mojave in force with the objective of occupying and repairing Hoover Dam. Rangers and army scouts had confirmed that the dam was basically unoccupied and could be restored to an operable condition. Upon arriving at the dam, however, they discovered that a large force of tribals and robots had occupied it. This was our introduction to the three families, the Securitrons and, of course, Mr. House. Using his Securitrons as intermediaries, Mr. House called for parlay. He claimed his forces had occupied Hoover Dam in order to safeguard it for our arrival, and that he was ready to turn it over to us, so long as we could agree to terms. Those terms became the Treaty of New Vegas. The treaty recognized Mr. House's sovereignty over the Strip and granted us rights to establish military bases at the Dam and McCarran Airport. The NCR is legally permitted to send 95% of the electricity produced by the Dam to our home states. The remaining 5% goes to the Strip. The treaty actually makes it illegal for the NCR to prevent its citizens or troops on furlough from visiting the Strip. Once on the Strip, our citizens are subject to arrest or punishment by House of Securitrons, though that's a rare occurrence. Our troops enjoy a different status. It's illegal for the Securitrons to take action against them. Of course, it's also illegal for our troops to carry firearms on the Strip, so there isn't much trouble they can get into. Our military police does an adequate job of keeping the troops on furlough in line. I don't envy them that task. The embassy was established a few weeks after the treaty was signed. Basically, Mr. House handed us a dumpy little building he had no interest in renovating. I'm the third ambassador to hold this post, and the first, I think, to accept its limitations. My predecessors had ambitions of engineering the annexation of the Mojave. They thought they'd convince Mr. House to join up. I've never even spoken to the man whatever he is. Maybe the situation will change once we've beaten the Legion once and for all. Go on. Now we mostly just keep track of the NCR citizens and troopers around and make sure they don't get in trouble, but that's Captain Papa's job. I keep myself busy with paperwork and reports that get sent back to the NCR. It's mostly busy work, but every once in a while we make progress. Okay, that's, that's actually fairly interesting. Goodbye. So Mr. House has the NCR wrapped around his little finger. Mr. House also has go the families of the Strip wrapped around his little finger. Mr. House seems like the biggest obstacle in all of this. There's one person who won't get wrapped around his finger and that's me. And whether he feels like he has me around his finger at the minute or not, I don't know, but... 
I certainly don't plan on keeping things working in his favour for too long. You're a shady character, Mr. House. Michelangelo's workshop. I am intrigued. Hello? Hello? Hi. Excuse me, but I'm busy. Okay. Who's in charge here? Somebody called Michelangelo, I'll wager. Hello? Looking around and curious. Hi. Oh, hello, I am Michelangelo. How can I... Uh, wait. Are you here to deliver more billboard requests? Please tell me you're not a messenger on behalf of Mr. House. Um, no, no, I'm not here for anything like that at all. Um, uh, who are you? Hmm, that's great to hear. Really great. I'm Sheldon from Vault 21, although here I go by my artistic name, Michelangelo. So what brings you here? Um, nothing really, I was just curious. Um, what, why are you so jittery about Mr. House? Because spending myself to the edge of artistic oblivion for Mr. House sums up my existence since I had to leave Vault 21. That's why. Huh. What's the trouble with Mr. House's requests? It's this place. My inspiration ebbs and I don't know how to stop it. Oh, I can't feel the warmth anymore. Um, it's really nothing to do with me. Well, all right. So, um, bye. Yeah, I, uh, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a shame. I'm, I'm sorry, but... I mean, I've no real interest in furthering Mr. House's interests. But still, this was a... An, an interesting distraction. If we ever have need for an artist, we know where to find him. Night. Yeah, I've seen this place at night. It's uh, it's definitely a thing. Well, I think we better pay these boomers a visit because, with or without their aid to the NCR, I think they would prove a boon to me. And uh, no, not not Boone as in you. I am a little concerned, however, of the reports that they fire artillery on anybody who tries to visit them. But I guess we'll confirm that rumour when we get there. Is there no quick way out of the strip? We'll just have to walk all the way around Freeside. You know, when we got here, I said I wanted to stay out of the politics of Freeside. And through a strange twist of fate, I find myself involved in the politics of the whole of Vegas. And it's something in which I want to play my hand very, very carefully and close to my chest, because so far as I can tell, none of these people are fit to rule. Some things are going on. The muggings here are not very efficient, I notice. Also, the kings do an awfully efficient job of keeping the streets quiet. Veronica, please Eat keep this. up. What? 
Is everything okay, boo? Who is that? I don't think they'll last very long. Just if he keeps going that way, the Securitrons are going to have something to say. Come on, let's get out of here. Only at Mick and Ralph's. Only at Mick and Ralph's. It can be bought. It can be found at Mick and Ralph's. Now. Where did we enter? This way. So. Yeah, that's right, because we. Yeah, we went into that. The old Mormon fought and found a few rather odd people. Although they do do a tremendous job, actually. I can't really be too harsh on them. What is going on now? You know, I think this is why they were trying to sell bodyguards before. But at the same time, they're really, really, really not going to get very far attacking in dribs and drabs like this all the time. What? Come on, we need to get out of Freeside. I'm starting to think that we are actually the intended targets of all of this. Hey friend, thanks for the information before. <laughs> I forgot to mention the fact that I'm the most important person here, right? strip on the free side. We need to be heading north east. I guess we're gonna be going off road a little bit as well. What time is it? Get kinda of late as well. It should be fine. In fact, the cover of night could be our best friend. Especially if they launch artillery. No trains coming, are there? <laughs> oh, there's one that never gets old. Okay, so we'll just follow this road and... Uh, well, with a bit of luck, it'll take us to the boomers. And with a bit more luck... We won't get boomed. Right? <sighs> yeah, I know. So, is it through this rock face here? There is a road that takes us there, according to the map. Is that the road? Yeah, okay, we'll just follow this road. Like I said before, follow the road. Just fail to take my own advice, that's all. I'm sorry that you are cursed with travelling with me. What? What are you fighting? Why are you killing Brahmin? I apologise if that's an odd question, but in my defence it's an odd thing to do. Are the Brahmin even hostile? Oh wow, the Brahmin are actually hostile. <laughs> okay. What an unusual situation to find myself in. Okay, that's enough hunting. Although... My pit boy's picking up something over there as well. I'm starting to think that... Uh, 
Going at night might not have been the best idea I've ever had. Is my map picking up the uh, the old highway? Is this a generator? It sounds functional as well. Isn't it? Let's go check out who these people are at the fire. Maybe we can share the fireside. Hail! There was some kind of massacre at one of the ranger stations. I don't know which one. Hmm. Prim wimped out and accepted NCR rule. Some people will do anything to feel safe. Uh, yeah, I was uh, the catalyst for that. Where's Boone? Boone. Boone. A lot seems to have changed. Hey there. Recently. I'm. I'm important. But the weird part about that is, is I, I was never the courier that everyone seems to think I am. Have I accidentally assumed someone else's identity in all this? This all seems too convenient to be real. I don't know. I do know one thing, is, uh, you can trust a chem addict, and, uh, I also trust ED with my life, so, I think we'll, uh, with, if you guys don't mind, we'll pull up by your fire and spend the night. Things are mighty strange indeed at the moment. 